Hey, Chance, how frustrating is this series as a whole, given how well you guys were playing coming into it? Yeah, it's very frustrating. Um, like you said, we were playing really well going into it, and those first couple of games, we just couldn't get any runs on the board. Um, kind of got off to a slow start in some of those games, uh, and then tonight it's kind of the opposite. But, um, yeah, it's frustrating. Uh, try to get back at it tomorrow. Brock, you're up. Go ahead. Chance, as far as how you're doing right now, uh, how would you describe how you're feeling at the plate, maybe what's different from you than – them some periods where you haven't had this kind of success? Yeah, I feel good. Um, a lot of the work that I put in this off season and quarantine time was to be able to um, repeat things in my swing and repeat on a nightly basis. And I feel like I'm able to do that right now. And that's obviously the goal is to be able to continue to repeat that. Joe Treza, you're up. Go ahead, Joe. Chance, getting back to the team, what what do you think the difference was these last four games compared to, say, this weekend when you guys were playing so well? Um, I mean, like I said earlier, it was just the first couple of games. We struggled offensively to put some runs on the board. Um, and then tonight, we just kind of battled back and forth. Um, couldn't, couldn't just lock it in at the end right there. But, you know, it's, it's the way baseball goes. Obviously, we had a really good sweep. Um, against the Rays, and then obviously these last couple of games weren't so great, but hopefully we can learn from it and get back to what we were doing a few days ago. Rich Dubrov, you're up next. Go ahead. Hans, um, you've always drawn a lot of walks, but your plate discipline seems to be even sharper this year. Uh, do you have a reason for that? One second chance, you're muted. Can you hear me? There you go. Yep, go ahead. Yeah, I was just saying, like I said before, um, I think it just comes with being in a good position to hit and being able to repeat that. If I can repeat it consistently, um, it allows me to see the ball better and put good swings on pitches and lay off pitches a lot easier. Have time for two more questions. Brett Hollander, go ahead. Hey, Chance, you've had good spurts before. Uh, do, do you kind of come into this season thinking you have something to prove uh, to the organization and yourself? Uh, yeah, I, I mean, yeah, I would say so. Uh, I, I know it's a big year for me, but um, I don't really have to prove it to myself, I guess. I mean, I know I can play here. It's just about doing it night in and night out, like I said before. And you said I've had good spurts, but it's just about being consistent with it. And that's the work that I put in this off season was to be able to do that and be consistent. Last question goes to Stan Charles. Go ahead, Stan. Hey, Chance, I just wanted to ask you something a little bit different. The pitching staff this year, their earn run average, a lot better than it was last year. What do you see from especially the bullpen arms and how much of that is dependent on how much deeper the starting pitchers are going? Both. They both play off each other really well. Starters are giving us really good starts. Um, and then the bullpen, when they're coming in, they're throwing strikes. I mean, that was kind of a big, big thing last year is we would fall behind guys and kind of get in those counts to where we didn't really – there wasn't really um, anywhere you could go, I guess. Uh, when, you're, when you're behind in the count, it's tough. It's really tough to pitch. I mean, they're big league guys, but – Falling behind, it's, it's a really hard thing to do. And this year, they're getting ahead. They're getting ahead quick, and they're putting guys away um, early in the count.